Hey YouTube, what's up? Welcome to this channel, Mark Lewis from A to Z, where I show you everything I do from A to Z. So this channel is filled with a lot of good stuff. But today, what I'm going to show you guys is how to make some turkey meatballs. Now, I'm not giving a full um, description in this video of how to make it. I will show you how to make it before full description. Head on over there to the Head Savage Kitchen channel. I put a link in the description so you can go over there and click on it and get there as soon as possible. Or you can wait to the end of this video and I'll post a link up here for you to click on and get to that channel. But before you do anything, hit that subscribe button. Watch this video so you can get to cooking and get your family to eating because I'm sure they hungry. They ready to eat tonight. Stay tuned. All right now folks, let me show you this little trick here to keep y'all meatballs consistent. What you wanna do first of all, make sure you got some water here. Let's kind of dip your fingertips in there. This is so your meat don't stick to you. But use your tablespoon, scoop your meat out and just roll you a nice little ball like that. You know what I'm saying? You can do all this with a little tablespoon don't overfill it just do it like so so you can have consistent size meatballs you know folks make it to be too hard you know but it ain't got to be that hard people we're gonna drizzle a little bit of olive oil because we don't want nothing to stick you know what i'm saying i'm dropping stuff just kind of coat that pan you know so them your balls don't stick we don't like sticky balls you don't like sticky balls. I don't like sticky balls. Who likes sticky balls? All right. Light. There we go. All right. Let's go on and get that heated up. Now that I'm babies on the stove top. All right, folks. Now what you want to do is get them nice and brown on each side. All right, folks. We are here at the last step. We're going to pour that in there. And we're going to let them babies sit there and broil in that chicken broth for a little bit. Till the chicken broth is pretty much evaporated, we're going to cover this up. We're going to be back in about 15 minutes, i say. All right, folks. After the, after the meatballs have soaked up all the juice, like you see here, they are through. They are ready to pair with anything you like. Man, you can put these on, you can eat them by itself. You can put them in spaghetti, noodles. Oh man, just the, the possibilities are endless. I mean, look at those. They are so mouthwatering and scrumptious. Oops, too much. Look at those. Girl. My wife just tried them, she loved them. She said she loved my balls, guys. <laughs> I hope she like my meatballs. She like my balls. Thank you guys for watching. Try this recipe. If you like it, man, let me know in the comments. Subscribe to this channel. Hit that thumbs up for a like. Tell your friends, your family, everybody about this right here. This is good for a potluck. Anything you want to do with it, man. I'm telling you, once they try it, they'll be back and they can't get enough. You won't get enough. Thank you for watching YouTube. Peace out. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Thanks for stopping by my channel. Hit that like button. Leave me a comment. I drop videos once a week. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a thing. Thanks for watching. Yeah, you know what to do.